All dry in Omaha this morning. It's off to our north where you see that pink on the radar. And I'm going to zoom in here because we're starting to get more reports of icy roads between Wisner and Norfolk. So really, uh, Coming Stanton and Madison counties. We're starting to see some icy stretches from some patchy freezing rain. Again, most of us green on the road conditions map. That's just fine. But as I zoom in here, you can see Highway 275 between Wisner and Norfolk, Highway 51 between Wisner and Bancroft. That's where we're starting to see some icy stretches. And that pink there is totally covered in ice. So there could be some really slippery roads across parts of the KETV viewing area early this morning. It's all north of Omaha where we could see that thin coating of ice. Eventually, this is going to get toward Ottawa, Denison, and Carroll, but all of it is north of Omaha. Parts of western Iowa might see a dusting of snow as we see some colder air come in this afternoon, but you can see that wintry mix is north of the Omaha metro through about the middle of the morning. Roads could be getting slick, and then by midday, anytime after 11 o'clock, we could see a couple of rain or snow showers in Omaha, but listen up. No icy stretches in the metro, no issues with road conditions for the majority of the viewing area. Midday temperatures, upper 30s and low 40s in Nebraska, low to mid 30s in Iowa. Still could see a couple rain showers into the early afternoon, maybe mixing with a little snow, and then dry for the evening commute. 5 o'clock temperatures, mid to upper 30s. A few clouds early this evening and then clearing out overnight. 10 o'clock temperatures right around 30 degrees. And there's that clearing that we're going to see heading into Thursday. Lots of sun tomorrow. Still kind of cold though, with temperatures around 40 degrees. 50s are back Friday and Saturday. Dry both those days. Maybe a rain shower Saturday night into early Sunday, and temperatures actually climb above average Monday and Tuesday.